This is my portable solar setup. Tell you a little bit about it here. Uh, it comes with a single 80 watt 12 volt panel. Um, you can expand that um, and add a second panel and we'll take and put a hinge on the aluminum sides. These are completely weatherproof um, so that we can take and expand, uh, expand into a second panel. Um, there are about 10 feet of wire which goes from the panel to the unit itself. The unit closes up. Um, it can't close completely up right now because we're actually uh, have everything set out. Um, comes with this cart. I won't have any names on it. <laughs> this is just uh, a cart for demonstration purposes. But the cart folds down, um, and then you take and put the unit on the cart, and you can pretty easily move the cart around. Um, the unit itself is uh, pretty heavy because we have a 105 amp hour battery inside here. So this is a deep cycle marine battery. will give you a lot of uh, power, uh, 105 amp hours worth of power. Um, in addition to that, we have uh, this controller, uh, or a power inverter. This power inverter will give you AC power up to 750 watts. Um, it will surge above that, uh, a little bit above that. And it also has uh, USB. So you can charge uh, your things directly off of here, your USB. Um, it will, this is currently keeping track of how much uh, voltage is in the battery. Um, this tells you what the output current is, AC. And when you have something plugged in, it will show you how many watts that particular device is using. Uh, the other thing that's really nice about this is, is it has a battery shutoff uh, and alarm. So um, if you're draining down your battery, uh, it will automatically shut this down when it gets to the point where it would start damaging your battery. Um, we've gone with uh, an MPPT charge controller. And the reason why we went with this versus a regular PWM charge controller is MPPT is intelligent and it will charge your battery much faster uh, up to about 30 percent uh, faster uh, because of the intelligent circuitry in there it knows exactly how to charge your battery and what's the most efficient way to do that so um, we went with the more expensive MPPT solar controller um, the other part of this system that uh, uh, you can't see very well. Down here we have uh, uh, a grid tie inverter. And the grid tie inverter is what is going to help you to take and pay this system off um, in energy savings for your home. And I will show you how that works. If we come back here, and you'll notice there's, there's cords hanging out right now, but uh, that can all be tucked away. I just left this out so that it was easier to see. Um, the way that I set this up, you can see right here this is a standard wall outlet type of configuration and it's polarized so that you have a larger and a smaller uh, blade that goes into each one of these so that you can't put it in the wrong way. What I just unplugged was the charge controller to recharge the battery. This is, goes to, directly to the solar panel and this goes to a grid tie inverter. So when I take and plug this into here now what I'm doing is I'm taking the power directly from the solar panel and I'm plugging, I'm putting it into that grid tie inverter. So let's follow these wires. The wires go down here into the grid tie inverter, come out the other end of the grid tie inverter and come into a standard AC uh, plug. So basically we follow this plug along. Back into the house we have a kilowatt meter hooked up that will show us what sort of power we are producing. So right now on an 80 watt panel, single panel, we are producing 65 watts of electricity that we are taking and pumping back into the grid in our house. And what this does is 65 watts of power will uh, go against whatever it is that you're using inside your house, which will reduce your electric bill. So if you were to leave this plugged in whenever you're not using this, you're going to be reducing your electric bill, and that's what allows you to take and pay the system off uh, by reducing your electricity bill month after month. So this system, as far as I know, is the only one that's designed this way. It actually allows you to take and uh, get the benefit of taking this for camping or tailgating, um, working, uh, let's say you're out in the woods and you need to have power tools, you can use this uh, setup for something like that. But it's also the only system that allows you to take and uh, pump power back into the grid so that you're actually paying the system off and uh, which basically reduces the cost of this over time down to zero for you. So um, thanks for watching the presentation. Uh, check out 
the notes above and let me know what you think. Thanks.